Hello everybody, my name is Periwinkle and today I have an awesome, awesome video for you guys. I know a lot of people are ready for Thanksgiving to eat and all that stuff and don't get me wrong, I love stuffing my face with turkey, actually not turkey, I hate turkey, ham. I love stuffing my face with ham and broccoli casserole and mashed potatoes and pumpkin pie. But I think the most fun definitely comes afterwards. And I'm not just saying that because, you know, Christmas time officially starts after Thanksgiving, in my opinion, but I'm saying that because it starts, you know, the biggest sale in all of the nation for basically every store. So if you guys don't know what I'm talking about, it's Black Friday or Brown Thursday, whatever you want to call it. I go on Thursday, so everyone calls it Brown Thursday, but it's, I consider it Black Friday, and it's basically the Shopping Olympics, and it's so much fun, and I'm ready to get some sales going, and I'm ready to buy everything, even though I have like 20 bucks, but that's the whole point of Black Friday, get so much stuff for so little prices. So I'm an avid Black Friday shopper. I've shopped for the past few years. I've gotten a lot of good deals. I've gotten so much stuff, usually for under a hundred. And I'm sure you guys have seen my videos. I am obsessed with Black Friday just just a little bit. So of course, you know, you have to have a plan for Black Friday. And I'm gonna tell you guys is my plan as long as you don't steal it. I'm watching you guys for what I'm going to do, how I'm gonna shop, and basically what I'm gonna be looking for at Black Friday. So, you guys will be able to see my haul this Friday, of course, at 3 p.m., you know, the time I usually post, but this is going to be my strategy going into Black Friday. Okay, so the first thing is that usually the sales really start around 6 or 7, and my family always eats Thanksgiving at 2. We are eating at Bob Evans, which will be delicious. So, me and Gabe are actually going to go together this year, so I'm going to be driving to his house about 5.30 or 5-ish, and then he is going to drive us to the mall first. We don't have that big of a mall um, locally, but it's still going to be very hectic because I swear West Virginians are crazy about Black Friday. So the first thing we are going to do is go to the mall. I don't know if just the anchor stores are open this year or every store. Usually it is just the anchors, but if it's not that, then we're going to basically peruse the whole mall and get as much Black Friday deals as possible. If it's just the anchors, which are Rural King, JCPenney, Belk, and Dick's, my main goal is to go to Belk and JC. Penny and look at their decor because I do really love their decor section and I'm also going to go into the Sephora inside JCPenney and check out their sales there if they have any. I want to give my mom a fan brush for Christmas so I'm hoping they'll have a sale on that. Um, usually they have a sale on lashes in Sephora so I may pick up some there. Um, and then also inside the mall if that is open I want to go to Victoria's Secret bath and body. I want to go to Hot Topic. I want to check out FYE even though FYE at our mall already has a 30 to 70 percent off sale going on because they're going out of business. Also Journeys would be cool to see if I could get some new shoes, perhaps a backpack. Um, at Victoria's Secret I really want to look at their Christmas undies, see if they have anything cute going on there. Bath and body of course candles even though I have too many Christmas candles and I keep my mouth shut there, but of course it's great gifts. Hot Topic, the shirts, I'm really looking forward to because I just, you can never have too many band or fandom shirts. And then probably at, um, where else do I want to go? At Journeys, again, shoes, backpacks. There's quite a few stores I'll do when I look at it there. Oh, and Hallmark, I want to see if I can get some discounted gifts at Hallmark. But those are my main ones. But again, I don't know if those stores are going to be open because, again, usually it is just those anchors. And then after the mall, after we shop in there a little bit, we are going to take off to the town kind of center kind of thing in Beckley, which is a short drive in the other direction. And what I'm going to be doing there is a few shops that will be definitely having sales because they do every year is Ulta. I got a liquid lipstick for like $4 last year when it's originally $8, so it was half off. It was great. Um, they have the NYX advent calendar last year. Don't know if they're having anything like that this year, but I'm going to stop by Ulta and check all of that out. Um, Kohl's, I'm definitely going to try, even though Kohl's seems to be like the main center for Black Friday shoppers. I'm going to see if maybe we can get something and maybe I can convince Gabe to stand in line for a little bit. Of course, you know, you gotta have a strategy. You gotta have a buddy in line while the other person shops and then let the other person go around. So we may actually bring Gabe's little brother to be our little line stander person. I don't know. I'm gonna try to figure that out. 
the coals will definitely be hectic. And then up on the top, we have Rue 21, which has the best sales in my opinion. I absolutely love Rue 21 sales. They do amazing with their sales, to be honest. I love every single bit of the, like, you can get a flannel for $3. Like, that's insane. So we're probably going to stop there. Maybe I can convince Gabe to pick up some Rue 21 Black if it's on sale, because I know it's really expensive. But it's such a good smelling cologne. Um, definitely going to look at their shirts. They probably have a lot of Christmas decor out, and I really want to check that out. Bam, I don't know if they're going to be open or Books a Million if you guys live under a rock. I'm going to check out Books a Million, see if I can get my hands on some, you know, Harry Potter merch that I can use as Christmas gifts or just other merch that people would rather enjoy for Christmas. That's mainly my Christmas stop is to look and see if there's anything there I can pick up. Um, other stores up there, we are probably, oh god, I'm going to regret saying this, we're probably going to stop at the Walmart. Ooh, that's going to be intense. We're going to stop at the Beckley Walmart, probably, and just check check it out a little bit. I know everyone's going to be there because electronics, just like Kohl's, it's going to be a madhouse. So that's going to be insane. But my main goal in Walmart is to just see the other deals most people aren't going for. Like, I'm not interested in electronics because, you know, all my TVs are working fine. There's nothing I really need to pick up. So I'm going to be looking at the Overlook deals, probably in the dollar store makeup section or, you know, the decor, just the stuff that nobody really thinks about but still is on sale. And then the last place we are probably going to check out is the Walmart in MacArthur, which every year the parking lot is filled to the brim. It's so, so filled and you drop past and you're like, wow, I'm glad I'm not in that. And then, yeah. But usually we get to that MacArthur Walmart. It's an every year stop about one or two in the morning and there's not too many people there because it's about to close down to prepare for the next morning when other shoppers come out. So usually we get there when there's not too many, but you know, it's still a lot for one or two in the morning and you know, just check out those two Walmarts. And then after that, I will have Gabe bring me back to his house, unload the stuff in my car, and drive home, and then film my haul the next morning. So I know I already uploaded a pre-Black Friday haul. If you guys haven't seen that, go check it out. But I have a feeling this Black Friday is going to be a lot, a lot more intense. <laughs> I have a very, very strict plan. This is the first time I can drive myself or have someone else drive me that I know. It is going to be very intense. I'm very, very, very excited for it. I'm like, I'm foaming at the mouth I'm so excited because I just love shopping so much and it's going to be such a good time to get some Christmas gifts it's going to take some stress off and you guys will definitely have to check out my haul coming up this Friday so anyway guys that was my Black Friday plan leave your plans in the comments down below I am so excited to hear them and yeah I'll see y'all later bye